say back in the building, you know what time it is, about that time, Bob, it's about that learning time. You know, when I'm in the building, when I'm in the billy billy, no, I'm in the, 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 okay, pack that, pack, 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 pack that, to pack that, crazy, so, um, yeah, 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 let's get into the tutorial, actually, let me not waste any time, let me not waste any time, so, um, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the, um, what's this, the mixer, how to use your mixer, you know, a lot of people, man, on your, don't know how to use the mixer, actually, the first thing is that you don't know what a mixer is, yeah, because people, people will be like, hey, how you master your songs, I've never heard nobody talking about mixing and all that, a few people, maybe, yeah, a few people, but mixing is part of making a good nice track so that's how it is so now i'm going to show you how to use a mixer how to side chain and everything and all that now i'm gonna tell you what this does what this does what this doesn't do this does and all that don't worry about that i'm gonna i'm gonna show you everything that i know about the mixer and then maybe you can like some things you you have to like you know you know teach yourself you know teach yourself so um uh without wasting any time let me let, let's get into the tutorial the first thing that i'm gonna i'm going to teach you is that i'm going to show you and explain it to you is this you have this this is a meter it's a meter a meter is the uh, same thing as this one you have this one uh, same thing as this one it shows you how loud your track is or, or if your track is pitching or what you know if it's too high and all that you know this is the meter so after that you have the master channel you have the master channel the master channel is a channel that affects every all the channels actually all the channels the master channel is the head the head if you hit somebody's head with like a, a rock, the whole body, the whole body will feel the pain. Will you feel the pain? Eh? And 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 and, and it, it won't function that well. Because because the mind controls everything. So this is the thing that controls everything. Everything in the mixer. You know, it's the master channel. So you have other channels, you have other channels. But this one is the master channel, you know when we talk about mastering we're talking about only this channel you know then when we talk about mixing we're talking about this channel individual channels this mixes all these channels then these are single channels if you put in your drum in here so i'm going to explain that later so this is the master channel so everything that you throw in here is going to affect every channel you know so let me give you an example now. So we have this now. So you see, this is a DPT meter. It shows you, it shows you where your track hits. So and then when you add in, um, let's add in just um, 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 let's add in just a simple compressor. So look at this now. Check this out now. I added the compressor on the master channel. So check this out. So it's going. To Is it? So it increases the volume of each and every sound. Each and every sound. The whole. That's why we call it mix say mastering, man. Mastering. You know, so it increases everything on the channel. So it affects everything that's on the channel something like that you know so then you have the um, what's this the 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 the, the separate channels isn't it? The separate channels so these are the separate channels without the mixing channel the mastering channel these are the separate channels. So, check this out, eh? So, this is the channel that's playing now. I can switch it off. No. 
so let me put this keyboard on on a channel pa then this is the channel see this is the channel so what i'm going to do i'm going to show you if this is the channel net so now you're going to add in like uh an eq so it's going to affect only that sound so you see so it only affects the 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 the, 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 the channel right? it only affects the 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 the, 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 the rooted, um what's the sound so sometimes if you want to add in a sound in the mixer you just do this come on the sound and this light this this green light just put it on this snare then just come in the mixer then pa pa channel routing net set root selected channels to this track pa. you see so now that's the snare right there the snare right there so you can add effects on it simple net so i'm going to show you another thing this is called side chaining side chaining let's say maybe you added like you added something like this something like this so this is just an example ne? this is just an example So you added like full effects, full effects. Now you don't have space, but you, you want to add more. So you want to add more. Ne? So this is a simple way of going about doing that. Ne? You're going to go to this um, free channel. I like to change colors mostly. Like maybe uh, just be like side chain effect. Then pop, that's that side chain effect. Then you're going to add in your effect. Let's say you add you add in uh, the the EQ, add in the EQ, cut in a couple of few frequencies, frequencies, you know. Then after that, then you this is what you do, ne? You just root your channel to this channel just connect the channels actually simple term connect the channels you just click click on this channel that you want to root you click on the channel that you want to root it on so let's listen to the sound you click here pop now you have this a rope a green rope leading to to the affected channel so so you see, if I switch it up.
it just does that né? so you see it's a fact thing it's working so and that's cool that's cool that's cool so you no longer have like you know to stop and all that you know and then you have your you have your 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 eq down here another eq you can use this or you can use another eq so this the eq for like the whole channel you know the the, the, the whole effect you see and then makes it much more simple yeah. then you have the knobs down here they are for the equalizer you know you can affect your channel however you want to affect the eq down here you know so it makes everything much more simple makes everything much more simple okay. so the mixer you have to be familiar with the mixer you have to familiarize yourself with the mixer you know then you you can say if, if you have like uh the your your presets if you if you want to save this preset let's say you like the preset you know you can use it so you can go to file save k k k k k k k k k k k save then next time when you want to use the 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 effect the 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 yeah the preset you just come in here part k k k there this part it just loads the 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 preset so that's simple same thing on the mixer you can do it on the mixer also so it makes everything much more simple you know makes everything much more simple uh you know um then yeah the mixer the mixer the mixer actually the mixer is vast as big so this way you change how your mixer looks actually you know you can change it however you want your mixer to look so this is that then this is that the knobs so i like using the knobs so i don't remove the knobs i won't remove the knobs then this is the you change how it shows the 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 the, the sounds so let's see how it shows sound now so when you change it it's gonna be like this so I like that. I like that. I like how it shows there. Then this is the finger. The finger, you know? So, and then you have a lot of options in here. You have a lot of options in here. You can create a group, like group sounds, like drums, you know, part, it will cut the mixer like that, something like that. Then. Yeah, you have a lot too. Yeah, sometimes you just go in there and just play with uh, um, um um just play with the the, the 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 mixer. Try this, try that, do that, do that. You know. Then you have the the left and right thingy, the left and right knob. So you have the left and right knob. Then, then listen to the sound. So now it's playing in studio so you can put it on the left side now it's playing on the left side only so now it's playing on the right side so you can reset it play the normal way in studio so yeah 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 and then that, that's, 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 that's simple that's simple man that's simple it makes everything much more simple it makes everything much more simple and if you want to disconnect this you can just press it here pa. disconnects from the channel so you can create another channel that you want so simple as that simple as that simple as that thank you for watching thank you for watching killer tone essay back in the building i hope you understood everything that i said i know it's difficult sometimes to understand but yeah this is for beginners mostly because beginners don't know what know how to use the mixer so i I hope that helped you you know i hope that helped you hope that helped you a lot because somebody once explained that to me and i understood that but not like right away it took i took time